Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome back to the GTA 5 videos channel. Today we are going to do an in-depth video on mini games and leisure activities. I hope you guys enjoy the video and if you do enjoy the video then please subscribe to the channel if you are new around here. Um, yeah, let's begin with the video. With Grand Theft Auto 5, Rockstar Okay, so the first one is pretty obvious. It's scuba diving. Um, with uh, your character, Michael, Trevor, or Franklin, you can just go underwater and explore the ocean floor. Uh, and there are thousands of things beneath the water that you can explore, such as shipwrecks or uh, kill some fish, uh, hunt in the water, whatever you want. But yeah. Okay, so that was the first leisure activity in the GTA 5 gameplay trailer. Try to reimagine the open world game in a number of ways. The game world is beautiful, massive, and diverse. A sprawling, satirical reimagining of modern southern... Okay, so first, I do think that we are going to get comments like, um, you forgot sailing with your boat or flying with a plane. Now, that was pretty obvious in, in almost every Grand Theft Auto, so that's just something that we skipped. That's something uh, pretty usual in Grand Theft Auto. So here is another one. I'm not sure if we can do this, but you can see a girl. Um, she is jogging, and she has the MP3 player on her arm, and she's just listening to some music. Now, I do think that we can do this in Grand Theft Auto 5 herself because we have uh, skills. We can train our skills. Okay, so I do think that in Grand Theft Auto 5, we can just uh, put some ear pods in our ears and just enjoy the music and probably run around. And um, we haven't seen this in any Grand Theft Auto before, so I do think that this is a new leisure activity. In California, covering mountains and oceans, expensive stores and strip malls, urban decay and untouched wilderness. Okay, so the next activity is jet skiing. Now, jet skiing is obviously something that we as well have seen in some Grand Theft Autos, but I do think that in this Grand Theft Auto, it's more gonna be for fun because um, you can see somebody uh, is on the back seat of the jet ski, and you can you can probably just rent a jet ski, and um, you can see that this jet jet ski says lifeguard on it, so he's actually just um, looking around, and yeah. I do think that th this is more like a leisure activity and nothing for uh, transport kind of thing, if you know what I mean. Beaches and backwoods. Okay, so in this scene, you can see a few people on a quad, and you can see some deers in the background, so you can probably hunt them. Now, I do need to say that this reminded me more of hiking, although they are on the quad, but um, this reminded me of hiking because you can actually hike on mountains in Grand Theft Auto V, and um, yeah, the quad just reminded me of that, so. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. The sublime and the ridiculous. Okay, so right here we can see some Space Rangers. These are actually from a GTA 4 TV show, and there are five episodes on a normal GTA 4 and one episode on the Lost and Damned. Now, right now you can see them just in real life, and you can enjoy watching them. As you can see, there are some people with mobile phones just recording them and having a good laugh at them because they're probably just messing around, and yeah. It's a leisure activity, not a mini game. And in GTA 5 on the TV, there will be new episodes of this epic uh, Space Rangers kind of thing. So if you enjoyed these, they're back. Greed and hypocrisy. You tell me exactly what you want, and I will very carefully explain to you why it cannot be. What? Damn. When not on a mission, the use of three lead characters also allow for a touch of voyeurism. As you can drop in at any moment and find out what your new friends have been up to. Okay, right here you can see Michael and Jimmy. Um, Jimmy seems a little bit upset, but they just got back from another leisure activity, which is mountain biking. And in Grand Theft Auto V, you can just go on your bike and have a good time or do some races against your friends online or whatever you want to do with your mountain bike. But, you know, it's another leisure activity and it's good and it's fun. They go about their days. Jeez, Pop, too much more of that and maybe I won't be dead by 35. The world is not only huge, it's packed with a vast array of things to see and do. 
Okay, so another leisure activity is pimping your cars. Now, pimping your cars was in previous Grand Theft, but not as advanced as it is right now, because now you can seriously do anything you want, and you need to buy your own vehicle in this game to just have it to your own, you know? In, in other GTAs, you could just steal a car, put it onto your uh, parking spot, and it's there forever, but it was stupid now it's your actual now it's actually your own car your license plate is registered to your name so that's pretty funny and yeah it's another leisure activity that you can do cars to customize planes to fly clothes to buy okay so another leisure activity is customizing your characters with their clothes and you can also uh, put some tattoos on them but um yeah this is another leisure activity and it's pretty epic bye sports to play Okay, so the first mini game in this trailer is playing golf. Now, golf was also in the Battle of Gay Tony, but not as advanced as it is right now, because you can see a lot of things on the screen. Um, the wind actually matters, the field actually matters, the height, the strength of your character, and you can see that the HUD, the mini map, has turned into the map of the golf place. So that's pretty cool. Play. Nirvana's to another leisure activity is just doing yoga. I don't see the point of just doing yoga, but if you're fucking bored and you want to hang around, um, I don't know, you just gonna do this, I guess. Pursue. Another leisure activity that we mentioned in the beginning of the video is just scuba diving. Now, I think this is a pretty epic screenshot we made right here, so I just want to show it to you guys, but we already uh, explained to you guys what it is, so yeah. Oceans to dive. Animals to spot, hunt, and be hunted. So this looks really advanced. This is actually just hunting on animals. This is Trevor zooming in on his sniper scope. On the right side of the screen, you can see it says 7 miles per hour going to the east side. So that means your bullets will actually get affected by the wind, which is um, going to be a little bit harder to shoot these animals. Now, I would prefer and tell Trevor to shoot at the belly because that won't matter what the wind is. But, you know. Hunted by freaks to watch, meet, and befriend. Take Get the hell out of here! So right here you see Trevor, he is just, um, I don't know, throwing that guy into the building. Now this is a bounty hunting kind of thing, you as, you as well had this on um, Reddit Redemption. You just get rid of people who annoy other people and they pay you for that, so yeah. There's also been a huge focus on mechanics in the game, to make every aspect as fun and fluid as it is broad. Everything from driving and shooting. Another epic mini game is going to the shooting range. Now you can see Trevor is just um, training actually, and it actually helps uh, the training because you have skills in Grand Theft Auto V. And if you want to improve on shooting, then you need to go to the shooting range and test some shit out. <laughs> Another mini game is playing tennis with your character. Now, right now, you can see Michael is playing against Jordan, and um, they're having some fun. Now, it would be really cool if you could do this online against some uh, friends, actually, because you know it's a pretty epic mini game. It doesn't actually affect anything. Like, if you win or lose, uh, you might just go into competitions and lose money, but it doesn't really affect anything. But yeah, it's a pretty nice mini game. To tennis and bike. Another mini game is biking. Now it looks really advanced and the graphics actually look pretty fucking awesome. Now you can see that he has been biking for 9 minutes and his position is on the third. So yeah, another mini game and it's pretty epic. Biting. Feels fun and responsive. Another leisure activity and as well a mini game because you can compete against your friends or uh, do some competitions, whatever you want to call it, um, is flying with your parachute. So it looks pretty epic and you can see that the parachute has a colors of a uh, rainbow. Now I do think we can customize our parachute because in some screenshots you can see that the parachute has different colors. So yeah, moving on. However, alongside all of this leisure, people also have to take care of business. Let's go! This is your moment! Please don't make me ruin all the great work your plastic surgeons have been doing! After the take is divided, you decide what to spend your money on. Anything from sensible investments, like tattoos and fast cars. Okay, so another leisure activity and as well mini game that was in other Grand Theft Autos as well is just racing against your friends offline and online. So it's pretty epic and I just had to show you this beautiful car. Uh, I'm not sure what car it is. It looks like a um, Koenigsegg 
CCX. Too risky. Okay, so another leisure kind of thing is just having stock exchanging and going on the internet. Now, something funny I noticed uh, that we have mentioned in other videos as well is that the mouse is a middle finger. Um, if you haven't seen it uh, yet, now you do. And yeah, it's just another leisure activity. You can buy stocks, uh, do whatever you want. Even Google Maps is on the internet, but it's an I find. It's everything uh, is in Grand Theft Auto kind of style so it's 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 different but it's cool ventures like stocks and los santos real estate and then there's grand theft auto online which we will show you properly soon Okay, so this has nothing really to do with leisure and mini games, but I just wanted to show you guys this because you can actually just do mini games online. Now that has something to do with it. Um, you can just go and have a bike race or have a car race online, as you can see in the mini map. And yeah, it's actually pretty fucking epic. And uh, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video because it took a lot of time to make. If you haven't yet, please rate the video. That is just all we ask from you. And yeah, thank you for watching and have a good day. Peace.